Piss off with your shit sample of a shit saw. This is Neuromancer, apparently. If it ever gets lined up. Where's the cassette inlay glasses? Let's have a look here, mate. Have a look here in it. It's going to be lined up for shit, I know it is, but uh, not much I can do about that. Let's have a look there. Yeah, is she loading? Uh, old or new game? New game, sir. Thank you. Enter your name. Osiris in cyberspace. With two R's, no. There we go. Come on, man. Just do the decent thing and show a picture on the screen. As Emilio Estevez said, I'm going to make you famous, but I don't want to be famous on YouTube. Quite happy with my little shit channel, thank you. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah, what is it with American games and too much fucking disc loading? Huh? What's going on with that? Could have loaded two fucking cassette games. Oh, great. It's a shit menu system. Great. Who actually makes this shit? Is this uh, Lucasfilm? You've just spent the night sleeping face down in a plate of synth spaghetti in a bar called the Silicon Dildo Chat Super. Okay. Yeah, I'm not getting the uh, joke there. After rubbing the sauce out of your eyes, you can see... I'm pretty sure that's pronounced Shiba City. Sky through the window, the colour. Yeah, look, I've got graphics here, mate. So why don't you show me these things instead of fucking writing something out? Oh, look, hurry up. I don't care if you eat that spaghetti or sleep in it, you've still got to pay for it. 46 credits. I think it's a terrible idea. Terrible idea. That's better than that shit sample. What does that fucking mean? the fuck is the patch? But that's disc loading and saving, is it? How the hell is that doing that? Fuck, how blocky are those graphics? Next! Sad thing is, uh, none of these uh, William Gibson f uh, novels will ever be made into a decent film. Johnny Mnemonic is too fucking cheap, mate. Some fucking uh, scrapyard at night and uh, they rented out a nightclub for the uh, evening, probably on a Wednesday when it's cheaper. And they called it a film. Oh, and they obviously went into a hotel or some shit. Ah, it's a rubbish film. I can't be doing with uh, cheap shit movies, mate. I really can't. Even films I used to like, now I can't watch them. Life is too short, mate. I'm not interested in uh, films with uh, fake trees on a set. Just go outside and fucking film it outside. Obviously it's possible because uh, Stargate SG-1 did it. Many times. I mean, you don't need to live in Canada. Or America to have forests like that. You've got Epping Forest round the corner, mate. Uh, see, I did actually want to play Caliph. And, uh, but the thing is, Caliph is propping up the camera at the moment. So there's that. The camera's a bit cockeyed anyway. So, uh... That's a good start. 
and we may even be able to type shit with the uh, camera in this position right we're playing Caliph I would show you the uh, cassette cover but obviously it's been used to uh, prop up the camera at the correct height to almost that's a terrible thing there's nothing I can do about that mate nothing you'll have to accept that and move on probably a shit game because uh, I thought it would be, be some sort of uh, <clears throat> arcade like adventure type thing but it looks like one where you have to type shit in so here's an example drop the photon cutters, wear the lenses Remove master or mast A with a space missing. Talk to Yagmok, press control button, fire plasma beam at door. These are a few sample commands, but as you can see, they range from simple to blah blah blah. Yeah, that's the one. Anyway, your challenge is to rid your home planet of the leech who is draining it dry and in so doing discover oh for fuck's sake and that is pretty much all the instructions on how to play the game wow they've been very ambitious with what they're doing ambitious but rubbish but there is graphics on the screenshots and there's no text on the screenshots so if I'd bought this I'd be as pissed off as when I bought Altair 4 mm. she's high street as uh... actually what's his <laughs> I can't remember his name now on the phone shop I think it's uh, Joe Wayne is it Anyway, the one with the Audi TT. Ash can't afford the car, and he's white. Look, mate, I didn't write the uh, script. Uh, it's a real fucking shit fest. Look, you don't even get a fucking loading screen. What the fuck is going on, mate? As you can tell, I'm not in a great mood to start with. And. I'm trying to think of uh, see I've disconnected the SD to IC so I could try this tape and if this don't work I'm limited to what I can load up next because I don't want to play shit games anymore well we could try loading a copy of Neo Clips I don't think I've done that on my channel actually we Sit rep, we've been out of biscuits for a week. Fuck me, what kind of clamshell is this? It's like 10% bigger than the fucking cassette. Doesn't hold the cassette in there or nothing. These must be like 8 track clamshells or something. You want to sneak uh... Yes. So there was no loading screen, no loading music. No wonder they only showed the uh, fucking Spectrum screenshots because everyone gets fucking Spectrum graphic. Right, next. 